Okay, so casual day. Morning. Well, for another round of tagging raid bullshit, huh? Another round. So when are you guys gonna actually stop this? Okay. Nice to see you guys say no. Yeah, this is our wonderful tent that we wouldn't let you take last time. We're not going to let you take it tomorrow either. In fact, I'm not going to let you guys take Jack's shit tomorrow. You can let Trish know. You guys got new shirts, eh? Looks like the stapler is not working. They're going for tape. Another day harassing the houseless. Life is good. I don't care about helping people. Ernie Martin said it himself. I think that you do. I think you do care about people. Why do you think that this is okay? Oh, look, that tape doesn't work so well. Oh, they're not using staplers this time? No, their staplers hey, fucked up. Hey, well, that's good. This is fucking leading to my toe. Baby. I know. You need to s sit down and put some pressure on that. I'll get to that in a few minutes. I'm not opening my tent for medical supplies while they're here. So you need to sit down and put some pressure on that. You guys really got nothing better to do with your jobs? Now that tape was falling off. How are you guys ensuring that people are actually getting notifications? Because most of these people, as a matter of fact, this particular gentleman who is recently out of a coma is actually at the hospital receiving medical treatment right now. Not that you guys give a shit about that, but I'm concerned that, that tape isn't going to last. Think you guys maybe maybe need to go hop into that budget of yours and get yourself a new stapler and come back tomorrow. Watch out, you're blocking the sidewalk, guys.
Yeah, this person's off at uh, Youth Outreach Services right now, actually working on uh, getting counseling and treatment and working on getting job placement assistance, something the Department of Housing doesn't actually fucking do. So while he's off trying to better his world, you guys are sitting here and doing this. Good job. Make you feel good. Make sure you get real detailed so that when we actually go to reclaim this shit, they don't have an excuse not to give it back because you guys actually don't do any kind of detailing. And it allows assholes to not return shit. The generator is operating at the moment anyway. Again, you're blocking the sidewalk. No, not you. you. Them. They should be apologizing to you. Oh, they should be fucking apologizing to every houseless motherfucker on this goddamn motherfucking island. But no, it's okay. You can torment them all you fucking want. Fucking assholes. Again, blocking the sidewalk. Something we really try not to fucking do. We have this whole, you know, keeping space thing. But you don't give a fuck about a single soul on this goddamn island, so it doesn't surprise me that you guys are staying there and not even trying to move out of the way to let people walk by. Assholes! It's what y'all fucking are! Worthless pieces of shit! People got jobs, dickhead! What do you think this camp has maintained its integrity all this time? Doesn't fucking matter. There'll be more chains tomorrow. You guys figure out how to cut us out yet? Are you going to rely on the EMS and fire department who actually refused to do it because they said they're here to help people, not hurt people? You guys are here to hurt people. Another day, another harassment, huh? I fucking think so. Guys are nothing but a bunch of Cretan and assholes. Motherfuckers. That's sad. We get a paycheck for doing this sort of thing. It's okay. He wants us out. He thinks we all need to go home because we're done protesting. This is what he talks about. Obviously not. You're not sorry. 
Why the fuck are you lying to her? I'm not, I don't like to see anybody cry. Then you stop know. doing what the fuck you're doing. You know why? I, I, I'm... You're tormenting people around this island on a goddamn fucking daily basis. And you're sitting here saying you're sorry. You know how you prove you're sorry? You stop doing it. If you keep doing it, then you're not fucking sorry and you're nothing but a fucking liar. Okay. Oh my god, are you putting down fruit? Pears! Gonna take count? Gotta make sure you get that detail right. We got pears here, we got bread, we got food for people to be able to fucking eat. Make sure you tag every specific note of it. Fucking assholes. <laughs> what the hell did I get in my mouth? Sorry, I didn't mean to actually do that towards you. I got something in my mouth. That was, very that was not intentional. And I just apologize. It wasn't intentional. Huh? You apologize to him though, right? Not to me. I'm sorry, I thought that was who was complaining. That's fine, I'll go apologize. When the fuck are you gonna apologize for what you're fucking doing? I had something in my mouth, I spit, I didn't mean to get it so close, as I sat there right there, and I will say it I'm down here. I also good. hope you fucking apologize for being the asshole that you are. They're not here to help, people. So now they're sitting here and tagging free speech. Another day, another dollar, yeah? Yeah. Smile for the camera, honey. We're going to 9th U.S. Circuit Court on this one. I know we will. It's okay. You're building my case right here every day that you guys are doing this. And we're going to start fucking following you and finding out your fucking routes. And we're going to sit here and videotape you harassing other houseless people. And when I sue this city, you guys are all going to fucking hear it. You guys are all going to have to find new fucking jobs. Because I'm shutting this bitch down. You gotta keep enforcing the unconstitutional laws in which they're doing every day. Yeah, Good job. I just would like to see that still happening before this happens. Until an injunction can be had to the Ninth Circuit Court. People are prohibiting them from the suction. Yeah, like people, like, like the tour buses come by. I think with the law, it's gonna be a safe place. There's all different levels of housing, affordable housing. We need more than that. Like There's people out here with multiple jobs and you're taking away the only shelter that they have while they're off at work. It's pretty fucking sick. Sick. It's sick. What you guys are doing and participating in and defending is nothing but vile sickness. And you feel good about it. You feel justified about it.
appreciate a damn thing you fucking do. And the entire police force needs to disband protect and, serve. and actually protect the people instead of the corporation. But just doing my job. Just doing my job. Try to sit here and figure out how to remove my artwork? Is there a reason you're taking items that haven't been tagged? Are you paying me these as yours? Yes. Okay. Make a note of that. And if we get it. What's up, what's up? No, this is a direct violation of the Ninth Circuit. You have property that's being claimed. You're sitting here and taking it without any kind of notification. That's a direct violation of the Ninth Circuit Court. There's no notification. There's no notification. This is completely wrong. This was a donation brought to camp. Uh, record this. I'm just fucking walking away. It's still recording. My sign, if you're interested. to the candidates, so they're just going to go ahead and take them, okay? okay. Nothing, no, no one's going to press charges or anything. They were brought here by someone who doesn't live here, but is involved. Oh. I don't want to fucking help this. Okay. 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 They belong to the What's Mr. Wesley Chan up to now?
Well, that's un-American, sir. They are concerned about a protest movement when they should be dealing with their ice and meth issues in this city, of which they have a real serious problem. But it's a whole lot easier attacking people in tents that are protesting than it is to deal with the real issues of this city. So therefore, this is what we wind up with. It's very un-American, Mr. Chun. You're very un-American, sir. Very un-American. As they are leaving and taking their... probably going to lunch now and enjoying a nice... lunch on the taxpayers' money, of course. There goes Mr. Chan. You notice their, uh, their license plates. Now the police are leaving as well. No more, they don't need any more protection here.